And it looks like the work that you guys have been putting into this is is this the the flywheel, as you can say, is starting to build momentum. And uh, it looks like you guys have already done a lot of work for yourselves, where people can see, you know, the momentum that they're joining. Right. Exactly. I appreciate that. Um, the roadmap. Uh, I know our, the R word is is not really looked upon fondly with all the people that have had roadmaps in the past and disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> so but let's go over your roadmap um, for the forge and and, yeah. and well it's it's very very um, short <laughs> but um, yeah we're holding a sacrifice which we tentatively um, thinking to start on Friday the 16th so coming up very uh, soon um, I will maybe we're we're gonna put official links on the curator website maybe tomorrow so people can go check it out and the countdown is there it's a very limited amount this is just for people to secure basically the tokens um that they can then use to lock up and become you know give out these super boats and secure allocations in the in the project right mm -hmm. and it's also the only way to get those nfts um so we want to make sure that it's really um yeah that the right people that get these nfts that will be able to to control this this platform in the future so that will start most likely on friday um once it is complete um we can then launch the the beta of the platform in early q2 so i would say one to two months is as you see as you see in the platform is, is already built and we've already had it in closed beta. So um, technically we only are gonna add a sign up um, page for, for projects and a couple of little tweaks here and there, especially to um, optimize it for the Pulse Chain community as well. Um, but yeah, the platform will be soon, uh, will be live very, very soon. And the first projects can come through. Um, that's, if you want to ask about more detailed longer term roadmaps, but I think these are the very important steps that are coming coming out, right? Um.